Hi, I'm Stefan Richter from TU Darmstadt, and I'm presenting Playing for Benchmarks, which is joint work with Zishan Haider from ANU and Vladian Kaltun from Intel Labs. Playing for Benchmarks is a benchmark suite for visual perception. It contains over 250,000 frames recorded at 15 frames per second, and each frame is annotated densely with ground truth for multiple visual perception tasks, such as semantic segmentation, semantic instance segmentation, optical flow, 3D scene layout, and visual odometry. We recorded the data set while driving, riding, or walking over 184 kilometers in a simulated virtual world in diverse ambient conditions, such as day, sunset, like you see here for the visual odometry, and now back to day, then sunset, rain, snow, or night scenes. To create the benchmark, um, we developed a, a new approach to collecting ground truth data from uh, virtual simulated uh, virtual simulations without explicit access to the source code or 3D content of the simulation. And here is how it works. So while running the simulation, as you see here, uh, we augment shader binaries uh, with additional input, output, and instructions to um, render out resource IDs and other rendering metadata. And then we can <coughs> basically annotate these resource IDs and get semantic class labels, but this is the only manual part. Everything else is completely automatic. So for example, by clustering resources by their transformation matrices, we can obtain semantic instance segmentations. As another example, by um, recording um, or rendering out dense 3D coordinates and tracing them through the rendering pipeline, we can compute optical flow or 3D uh, scene layout at the object level, also visual odometry. We conduct statistical analysis um, showing that the composition of our scenes, of scenes of the Viper data set, as we call it, for visual perception, um, closely matches the structural composition of real world data sets, such as cityscapes, for example. We further validate the realism of our data set with a perceptual experiment comparing our data set to other synthetic data set and find that ours is the most realistic. You can find the data set and the benchmark suite at playingforbenchmarks.org. Thanks.